Her first um, my first money since I got her from the house. It's not on your money. No, on your yeah. life money. No, fraud, fraud, no, fraud, no, fraud, no, fraud is a witness. No, oh, sorry, oh my god! Ten thousand dollars. Not on your money. Not on your money. No, no, it wasn't no, even no. promised. It's oh, can do. Uh, <laughs> thank you, ma. Thank you. Very, very proud thank of you, darling. So much, ma. Very, very, very proud of you. Jesus Christ! Now I'm feeling so hot. <laughs> You listen to that video, F Mercy and Fred were like, that's the first money Mercy is getting. Obviously, Fred, Fred got money from MC Galaxy, amongst others that I probably don't know. But MC Galaxy was Mercy's manager, so obviously they fell out because clearly she has new management. Only God knows what happened there. Anyway, yeah, we live and we learn. One good thing I would say I appreciate about this housemate is that they didn't carry any of their fights outside the house. Like everything just remained in the house. They came out, everyone in school with everyone. Although fans are still the ones carrying unnecessary beef on their heads, so but you guys should quit because it's not necessary. Anyway, enjoy the rest of the video, guys. As they say, all good things will eventually come to an end. This might be the final recap, catch up I'll be doing with BB Niger Housemates 2019 Pepper Dem Gang. Except something outrageous happens that I have to talk about it. This episode, we are going to obviously, you've seen Mercy's new earnings, fraud as well. We're going to just catch up with Tacha the top five and Mike's wife. So we'll also talk about the endorsements they've gotten so far. I'm just going to show you pictures really. Obviously Esther with Payport, Venita with Darling and um, she has another brand. I'll put a picture of Marshala and Shay, you know, they are busy recently. Mike just hitting things up with his wife and everything. And yeah, basically just a general catch up, catch up with everyone. Enjoy this video. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. The finale, and he asked you if you had feelings for Tatcha. You swerved my nigga. What's the point of asking a question that doesn't need an answer to? You know, you could have just said no, right? Okay, no. <laughs> Quite frankly, she is a good person, uh, but she has her own world, her own space, mm -hmm. and she likes respect. And when it's in that place, it's only what she feels is right it, that is right. Mm -hmm. That's not what you mean. I was one of those people that were very vocal about the fact that I didn't like how arrogant she was, I didn't like the attitude, all that. I got thrown for it. Her fans, yeah, yeah. There. Ogbonge Odogu <laughs> Thelma. Okay. You admit that one, I think. Yeah. You want to push some people past their limit sometimes because you do not know how or what is within them. Yeah, I really am sorry yet again, Thelma. I really did not mean it, to be honest. I think I was just really angry. I'm not going to say because I drank is an excuse. I'm supposed to still know when to hold my words and how to use my words. And I'm very sorry for the things I said to you and to your family. Like, it really, really bothered me, but glad that you have cleared that up. People of the internet had this whole thing about how you always talked about the fact that you came from a, a prestigious family. I, I, mean, I came in there as she, and I have left as she. And then the way you spread your arms, like, bring it on, I, I thought, like, she was to fight. I was not provoking. You want to beat me, I mean. <laughs> the blue, I'll collect the black eye. But you will go... I'm sure. <laughs> Saturday, Saturday night, night now, yeah. exactly now, where we have mixed the Jameson and the beers together. Mm -hmm. Science students. Who mixes beer and liquor? Flirt. Before you became a good boy, Ike. Yeah, my sister. Love you very much. We're together yesterday. You seem to be very open about your relationship with your ex. It seemed like you came from a place of hurt. I'm good. You're I'm good. good. Oh, you've spoken with her yeah, just after the show. I'm and... good. Just, just good. It means we should move on. Yeah, very smart girl. <laughs> Worry. Streets of blah blah area. Was it like a ploy to sort of get support from that area? You remember the part that stole my coin? Ah, I remember. I asked if you don't worry. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> I, I, I had to go into worry from then. I told him I'm happy about him even taking my coin. Not for that. I don't think I would have made it to the final. He probably just be on my show because I was still trying to figure out everybody. I wasn't allowed. Mm -hmm. When I reached inside the house, everybody is um, speaking English. <laughs> to, Cash up with these people, so I was trying instead of me being, I was trying to fit in. Sudden death, I feel when I know okay, this is not people outside, yeah, and I can go home now. How do you think I'll feel? I take a beg now. I don't get any problem with Messi, Tasha, Venita, or any of the girls in the house. Please don't change. Would we'll be celebrity now? See me, I'll be a superstar now. People they take pictures of the back of the road. Oh, you're calling your man. Slow tiger. I think we squashed that within two weeks, I guess, and 
we're cool. We cannot not talk about Esther. Like, really, we have to. So, um, there was this narrative on Twitter, the Hollywood character called Tony Mays. Oh, That's darling, darling. People are like there are similarities, you know, like the things you used to do in uh, movies when you were doing with uh, Esther. <laughs> when you're in a reality show like Big Brother, people would always make memes out of stuff. Yeah. It's amazing. You just have to, you know, have fun with the process. I don't know. That's the... <laughs> Esther is a um, wonderful friend. We have a unique relationship. But at this point, everybody's concentrating on building their brand, talking like we're good. Okay. It was bought at the time I could afford it, and then I prayed and prayed because if you know, it's always it's sure that fraud will start on Sunday. Like people don't even have to, you know, on Monday first time, first time that we I almost started to vote. So I wanted to stop that narrative. <laughs> I don't stop praying. Never all people to get it. Fraud. The stone that the builders has re have rejected fraud. has become the chief fraud. cornerstone. I'm very happy for you. You're tearing up. <laughs> yes, it's tearing up, guys. Oh. <laughs> yes, after that veto swap happened, you guys, your relationship was very terse. You know, he was head of house know, that week and he lifted up this sign mm -hmm. saying that he had won. Twitter went crazy. <laughs> like that, God will prepare the table before you <laughs> the presence of your enemies. I that literally, like, in quotes, your enemy raised up the thing My for goodness. you. you know? <laughs> Welcome to Nigeria! You know it's my first time here. I was receiving love before I even stepped into Nigeria. Mm -hmm. I've been saying I'm an extra housemate. <laughs> I'm always used to waking up next to my yeah. I'm actually obsessed with the show. When I was in the UK, I was watching it religiously. I would come home, Mike was just about to go in. It was like a bit of a sense. Mm. He went into the house just three weeks after you guys got married. Correct. Um, me and Mike, we both travel a lot. The difference between Mike being on Big Brother, I couldn't phone my husband. Yeah. I couldn't WhatsApp my husband. That was hard because when he when he told me about the show i was like you're doing it see the audition process was a next level mm. he got through first time around some people have to go for many auditions yeah. and i'm not that type of person to be like no you're not doing that it was for the business reach africa everyone fell in love with mike the yeah brand, which isn't a bad thing at all uh, so we have mike the brand and then we have aries there was a, an issue when he had a fight with one of the housemates and some of the fans went crazy and some of the sort of heat went towards you I'm so glad that I'm a tough cookie I saw it, I saw the trolls, I got added You do not know me I never ever retaliated to the comments that I was getting Perfect So there's this narrative that um, Nigerian men in quotes aren't faithful Mike literally shattered that narrative Why did you push him to do the show? I trust my husband mm -hmm. He was very confident in, in himself that he has eyes just for me. So women look in a certain way. Mike knew what he had at home mm. waiting for him. A lot of times when he was speaking about me, I'll just smile to myself and it was that reassurance. We listen to his diary room because I've listened up for my shout out. Ah oh, he's thinking about me. I'm always walking around with my head high. Yeah. I'm very proud. They're both athletes was that literally what drew you to him? It was through sport. Yeah. I mean Mike um found one another. I was actually with somebody, so it was just like, I thought, oh, he's good looking, you know, Mike mimicked the way I spoke, <laughs> and it sounded too good. <laughs> like, who is this guy trying to sound like me? Turns out, obviously, even though he was in the States, he was uh, born in Britain. It was when he came to the UK, and I, I was single, and uh, Mike reached out to me, and uh, kind of, it just kind of went from there. Oh, guys, look at her smile. <laughs> yeah, because yes, it's here. It, 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 it is a nice, it is a nice story. Thank you for everybody who supported my husband. Cruise Topia. You're also captain of the Mind Your Business ship. Stay in, in your happy place. Have fun every day. Live in the moment. Uh, oh, Marshall and Tasha are like, yeah. kept doing what you were doing on your bed. And I'm just yeah. like, how is this guy doing this? In the words of mercy, I drink my water, mind my business. MC Olo, Mo. <laughs> Thank you so much for all of your support. Earning about your, you in the house, my fellow housemate, our martial arts, actually very educational. It helped me respect you even more. Uh, every day every, of that last week was the last Monday I went to the yeah. house, so I don't remember half of what I had said. Oh, let me tell you. I was requesting to see um, Summer Kim. I <laughs> that Kim. Went into my anthem. That was it, full ground. Martial was like, oh, you need to stop yelling. And you said to him, now you know how I feel when you speak to me. Is that what I said? Yes. Oh, <laughs> martial or Ike? Ike. 
EK, um, I mean, EK and I, we have similar backgrounds when it comes to environment, to mm -hmm. where we was raised. So at the house, we realized we actually have mutual friends. I would hope to generally have relationships um, that last long beyond, beyond the house with all of the housemates. Post BBM. I want to, you know, continue to grow how I can get my myself positioned and, and full ground here mm -hmm. in Nigeria. So. On assuming. I am. Gentleman. Sorry. Lady. Jackie. Feisty. Vanita. Ratchet. 21. <laughs> Joker. EK. Cunning. <laughs> Biggie. Diplomatic. Jeff. Two-faced. Kathy. Creepy. Ninja. Sweetheart. Cindy. Stepper. Dama. Charming. Joe. Honest. Amashala. Quick-witted. Cindy. Wise. Sorry. Daddy. Yeah, like daddy. <laughs> Skip. <laughs> <laughs> As in, <laughs> most people be shady because so creepy. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> boring. Quiet. I wouldn't say boring at first. Diane. Lazy. Shade. <laughs> Flirt. Shade. <laughs> Loud. Mashallah. <laughs> you got disqualified. Uh, any regrets? Yes. Regret not walking away from what happened that morning. All she's trying to say is that anywhere there was is any problem, you were involved. <laughs> That's what he's trying to say. <laughs> so let's, he's trying to put it nice let, let's, let's cut all this, cut all the PC stuff out. <laughs> anywhere where there was trouble, Tasha was involved. Oh my God. Why? Uh, why? Wow. Like that Balotelli t-shirt, why always me? Why, <laughs> why always, why me? always why Tasha? Why always Tasha? Yeah. Um, I'm, I'm a blonde person. Mm. I'm okay. the kind of person that you would do something wrong and I just don't want to walk away. A young lady and there are a lot of young ladies out there who admire you, look up to you and so would you say in all honesty that you're a good role model? Be honest. Um, good role model? Well, I'm on the perspective of seeing models or, or having people you look up to and just yeah. taking what you need from these people. The yeah. positive okay. part. Not everything. I, I do have people I look up to but not that I look up to you totally 101%. I just look at you, oh, what do I love about you? And then I pick it, what do I love about this person? And then no, I but I'm so, talking about you me, being a role model to other young ladies out there, younger than you coming through. If they watch that, watch your behavior over the 90 days or whatever it was that you were there, mm -hmm. would they? Would you say, okay, uh, I want you to behave like me? I want you to be business driven. Uh -huh. <laughs> That's a part of you. Yes, I want them to be. I want them to be so young and strive for what people will tell you. Not to copy. Not to copy. No, not to be non-diplomatic because uh -huh. I mean I got disqualified. So, okay. yeah. so, so yeah, both fund, go fund me that was created okay. and stuff. So yeah, people did donate. No one dropped the money because we had someone. Yeah, right away. <laughs> people, people did donate money. Uh, okay. How much are we look? Are we talking about? Oh wow! <laughs> <laughs> you got somebody on the outside. Yes. Really? I, I always did say that in the house. Take your twin brother. Sorry? Wait, uh -huh. <laughs> yeah? Twin, what, what'd you say? My twin. Your twin? I call him my twin, yeah. Oh, you call him? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. We're yeah. okay. yeah. talking about years. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, that that long. Yeah, that long. Oh, so, okay. how come you got David O tattooed on your chest? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, what do you want? I love David O too, but no, yeah. no, my, <laughs> not on my girlfriend's breast. <laughs> It doesn't have a problem. So he kisses really David good night every night. <laughs> so leave no transfer. But what, what made you so stuff. confident that you were not going to leave on that Sunday? Self, um, instructive uh, motivation type of stuff. Like I needed to just boost myself and motivate. Then there were people that you didn't exactly get along with, e.g. Tatcha, until you guys had that big fight. No. That blew up. But then, uh, this is this is this is a situation I don't want to go back to. Like. Let's talk about the tears on the night that Tasha was disqualified. Can you run me through how you were feeling? What exactly made you cry? Oh my god, you see what I was doing. Because people want to know, like... <laughs> the tears was real. Yeah, it, it, it was real. Because um, this is a person I've not had, I've not really had. We've not cried in the house. Mm -hmm. And it, it's not like we're avoiding each other. It's just that we respect our space, we respect our space, I respect my face. And then what happened happened, we let our anger get the best of us. So I felt, I felt really bad because I, I at a point too, so I was crying because I could, I could have been disqualified. So I thought so. How did you do it messy? People were saying that you do not repeat one outfit. How many boxes did you bring into the house? 
It's <laughs> like like when you are going for a job interview, mm -hmm. in the place of your dream, like it's this place you wanted to work there, or you've been working somewhere, and there's this place you've been applying, and then they now call you for an interview. You'll be prepared. Mm. You will read outside the bus. You even, if there is time, you lecture them on what, you won't be going through their questions. You lecture them with what you have with your own knowledge. That was what happened between me and the house. I was ready. This is something I've been trying for so long. And then it happened. I mean, it's not like you auditioned four times. Yeah. Yes. In fact, after my audition, that's when I started picking up clothes. And mm. when I said, okay, if I make it to the house, then this one will be good. I was just speaking into my. I didn't even know. I was just speaking into my. Room. Any clothes I said, I said, okay, this one. Wow. You guys, yeah, there's something to learn here. Hmm. Yeah. As in preparation. Yeah, I think it, it helps a lot. Yeah. Happy birthday. I hope you're having fun. My name is Nicola. I'm your biggest fan. Sorry that you didn't win the competition. And, and don't give up. You do a great time on your birthday. God bless you. Bye, Amosela. Sweet kiss. Bye. Oh my God! Thank you. Thank you very much. Like when I came out, I found out that for my chest. Cheers. Cheers. Fraudly. The millions you make. <laughs> Fresh and all. Fresh and all. And Guys, hello, hello. <laughs> I want to officially say, because I've already welcomed her. Get it. So I want to welcome my sister. Hey! 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 We're gonna have two packs of coffee. Whoop, whoop, whoop. My own, my own. You are hereby declared to call me Senior Bissola. Senior Bissola. Ah, almost you give me salute. Eh? I'm a police ever salute in your life. I'm a met police ever salute in your life. Hey, she just give me. Hey, hey, hey. hey. Welcome, Helen Bay. <laughs> Don't you know that life is full of surprises? You better realize, better realize